hello ladies and gentlemen welcome back to my channel this is x2 hostel here on this channel we talk about football and we also give football prediction on mag days today i will be doing a kind of documentary we'll be talking about the most relegated players in the history of premier league some of them are players you never believe they are part of it i'm not talking about players that are unfortunate to relegate with a team maybe because they enter the wrong boat with jonah we all know the john um the story of jonah in the bible god sent him a message he entered another ship and tried to run away he because he was there the ship had an issue and wanted to sink so i'm talking about the jonas themselves people that are specialists in relegating teams we'll be talking about the five most relegated player in the history of epl believe it you are gonna enjoy this video before we proceed i would like you to do me a favor just hit the like button below and also for those of you that have not subscribed to this channel kindly do so and don't forget to hit the hit the bell notification icon just below this video subscribe and hit the bell notification icon so that you don't miss any video coming from us like i said before we do football analysis on a match day and we give free predictions and also we do football com documentary just like the one we are doing now let's get started okay the first journal we are going to talk about today is let me call him like uh, those uh, wwe commentary mr sebastian person yeah you all know him the cameronian international who has been a jonah i mean a serious one has been relegating teams both in premier league and in the in french league okay just as the record have it he was part of the people that relegated newcastle in 2009 then he repeated the same thing with wolves in 2012 and also with norwich in the following season 2014 and he went in and came back with norwich in 2016 he relegated them again then he also relegated team in french league twice I mean, this guy is just a very, very, very serious Jonah. And he happened to be a Cameroonian international, Mr. Sebastian Basson. That's the first person on our list. We move further to the next person. Okay, the next person we're going to talk about this morning is Mr. Robert Green. You know, this England international, the England goalkeeper, widely known for his blunder in um, 2010 world cup in the u.s this guy is just a genius when it comes to relegating team though he's not the most relegated player but the guy have his own record in 2005 he was part of the norwich team alongside mr Bassong. the okay yeah he relegated norwich before Bassong. he relegated norwich in 2005 before moving to west ham and also he helped them sink that's the work of a Jonah anyway. Then that was um, in 2011, he relegated West Ham. Then he moved to QPR. And he relegated them in 2013. When QPR relegated, he still remained there. They came back. Then in 2015, he sank them again. This is a very good Jonah to talk about today. And is an Engl England international, the England goalkeeper should i say ex england goalkeeper okay yes yes he's ex england goalkeeper mr robert green okay he's the second journal we talked about today and we are going to move on to the next one remember if you're just joining us we are talking about people that have relegated team the most in epl in other words they are jonah they join a boat and the boat have problems sink they move on join the next boat and they sink again 
So we are talking about Jonas in the EPL. Moving on to the third person on our list. Guess who we have here? Oh, the Johnny Man. That's what he's called. Mr. Marcos Bent. Do you remember him? He was called the Johnny Man because he played for a total of 15 clubs. Wow, what a record. He was part of four teams to have relegated from the English Premier League. Wow, Mr. Bent. Why are you such a Jonah? And this guy has a record. He started experiencing relegation at the age of 18. When he was part of the Crystal Palace team that got relegated, he was just 18 years of age. Then he was relegated the second time in his career during his time in Ipswich. Though he was on his, should I say, the best form of his life, yet he was part of the team that relegated in Ipswich. And also, he repeated the same thing with Leicester City and also with Charlton. So, we have talked about the third person, which is Marcus Bent. Okay, we are here again to the number fourth name on the list we have for today. That is the Jonas. People that are specialists in relegating teams. Let's say you want to relegate any team. You can just acquire one of them. Okay, let me tell you what to do. We're talking about Heyman Hederson. Who happened to be the fourth person on our list. And also, he hold a joint record with the next person we are going to talk about. And you can never guess who that person is. Because... You never saw it coming. We are talking about Mr. Heyman Hederson, who happens to be an Iceland defender. This guy is just something else. I mean, a talented relegator. Do I get that English correct? I think so. He's a talented relegator. He has relegated every single team he has played for on English Top Flight. Wow. Okay. Let me tell you, if you are a Manchester United fan and you want your top rival like Manchester City to get relegated, forget about the money. They have the money, but this guy can do wonders. Just buy this guy, give to them as a donation. Believe it or not, just next season you see Manchester City sinking. That's what this guy can do. I'm talking about Heyman Harrison, who has relegated teams like Crystal Palace, Wembledon, Ipswich, Charlton Athletics, and Botmouth. Guess what? This guy managed to, to make 300 appearances in the English top flight. Though he was a very good player, but because... The guy is a destined Jonah. He can't help it. He can't help being a Jonah. So the spirit of Jonah, or oh, he always manifests his Jonah nature in every team he played for. I feel sorry for him. And I feel sorry for those teams. But, you know, you can use him to bring down your opponent or your rival. Just buy this guy, donate him to any team at all, and they will get relegated. Okay, we're moving on to the next person, and you never believe it, because this guy is something else. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome the number one on our list. And he happens to hold a joint record with Mr. Hema Harrison. But... This guy is a good relegator with a difference. I'm talking about Nathan Blake. Do you remember him? The Welsh striker, Nathan Blake. Alongside Harrison, he holds the record of most relegated player in the history of Premier League. His career as a relegator started in 
1994 when he relegated Sheffield United. Then he suffered a, should I say, enjoyed three relegation in a row. I mean, relegated first team, joined the second team, relegated the second team, joined the third team, and relegated the third team. He started with Sheffield United. After that, he hopped into Bolton and relegated them, joined Blackburn Rovers, relegated them. What a career this guy have enjoyed as a footballer. Though this guy have retired after relegating Wolves in 2004, but I'm sure he has a son or maybe a daughter or a grandson. You know, thing runs in the blood. Just trust them, get them to relegate your rivals. Like I said before, if you can buy this guy or his upstream with him and Harrison, wow, the next team they will be playing for will be relegating down to non-league, believe it or not. Okay, these are the Jonas that have played in EPL, in the history of EPL, the Jonas that have enjoyed and manifested their attribute as a good relegator. So that is it for today. Please like this video, share it with your friends, and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel. What we'll do here, we'll talk about football, and also we give out predictions on match days. Thank you very much, and God bless you.